what's going on Leaf Nation, it's Leafer back again and welcome back to episode 2 of Road to Matthews. So in today's video uh, we have a ton of packs, I did finish the Hut Rush um, battle pass if you will, I also have some Hut Rivals packs to open, um, so we're hoping to pull someone huge obviously. Um, but if we don't, again, the gold players are great for gold collectibles. So regardless, we're getting closer and closer to that 95 Matthew. So without further ado, let's get into the video and open up some packs. All right, so we need players for the Matthews to get gold collectibles and all that good stuff. So I've been grinding some hot rush. We got some little packs here, nothing too good. So we got a mini players pack. I just need gold players. Got to make these gold collectibles for Austin. Cole Perfetti, and if we were to pull something good, that'd be great too, but I doubt it. So, three gold players, or four gold players, that'll help us towards making the collects. Got a premium pack here. McDavid on the cover. Gotta be something. I haven't pulled anything good in so long, dude. It's actually unreal. I doubt we're gonna pull anything in this, though. Okay. Um, that's not bad. Oh, he's slow. Um, 85 overall team of the week. Neil Pionk. Sure. Sure, sure. And now we got a premium three gold player pack. One of them's 80 overall or higher. And that's going to be Gabriel Landeskog, and that's it. But, hey, these gold players are going to help us get Matthews, that's for sure. All right, so we finished the Hut Rush Battle Pass. So we got some packs here to open. Hoping to pull something. We still need players towards that Austin Matthews to make gold collectibles. Um, if I can pull Team of the Week Marner because I need to buy him, that'd be great. If I could pull Primetime Riley, that'd be great because I need to buy him as well. So anything here will be good here. So again, just gold players ideally. But if I can pull those two guys, that'd be great. So we got three gold players so far. Jake DeBrusque being the best one. Um, is there anything else in this Prime Pack? These Prime Packs usually aren't the greatest. And... They're, they aren't, but hey, we take the gold players and we run with it. Okay, we got a premium four gold players pack. We, so we get four gold players, 280 plus or higher. So let's see what we get here. Spurgeon, and that is it. Jeez, us, these are horrible. They're horrible, but they're giving us players, so they're not that horrible. Let's go with the jumbo premium pack. We're going to skip this right off the bat here. Doesn't look like we pulled anything. Barzell, we do need him, so I can sell the one that I bought. 500 coins there. Sorelli, Matt Murray, another 500 coins. So that's not bad. That's going to buy us some players that we need for collectibles. Not a bad pack, I guess. And now a player's pack. We get one plus, 180 plus overall player. Hopefully it's more than that, though. Uh, oh, there's silvers in this, eh? Okay, so we take the gold players and we run with it. We pull the bronze in this pack. Interesting. Who's going to be our 80 plus overall? It's going to be Ilya Mikheyev. Oh, and Braden Point. Not bad. So, decent packs. Good players to make us these gold collectibles, though. That's for sure. All right. So, we have our rival rewards ready to be claimed. I think we're going to go with the untradeable option. We get two Jumbo NHL players packs, two premium player packs. Again, we need the players for the gold collectibles. So, it's smarter to go untradeable. Now, if we pull something good, we hope that it's good where we can just throw them onto our team here. So... Plain and simple. So we're going to save the Jumbo NHL players packs for later. Here we got the premium players pack. So we get 10 players, um, at least 280 plus overall. So if we look at it this way, we have 20 players with these two packs. We have 40 players with those, with those two packs. That will leave us with 60 players. So that's one gold collectible if we look at it that way. So I think it was worth the grind. We need the gold collectible. So if we could pull something huge, that's obviously a plus here. So we get two plus 80 overalls um in this pack that's one of them not the greatest here joey anderson Jaden schwartz their second 80 plus anything else oh okay okay team of the week alex de brincat the funny thing is, is i was looking at buying his 85 for my team build we're just gonna throw his 88 on there magician and gladiator this card looks absolutely unreal close personal friend of don't be saw 20. Alex DeBrincat, um, 91 speed. He's got a very good shot. Um, I'm happy with it. A purple pull in one of the um, worst packs. 88 ADVA. It's been a while since we pulled something good. We finally pulled something that's not a base purple. So, Team of the Week DeBrincat, we will take that. He is definitely going towards our team. Second pack here, Craig Anderson, Ryan White, Seth Jones. So, those are our 280 plus overalls in this pack. 
I don't think we're going to pull anything else after pulling that ADB. We get the Zingle, we get Allmark, and that is it for this one. But hey, can't complain after the last pack. All right, now we got the two Jumbo NHL Players pack. This is 20 items, all gold players, uh, with at least 10 80 plus overall players. So we get 10 of these guys. Better chances at pulling something good. Um, Evgeny Nabokov, that's a throwback right there. Uh, Gergensen, come on, something big. Let's see if we can top that 88 um, ADB here. So here we go, Fasca, Cody Eakin, James Ryan, Relief Legend, love that guy to death, man. Uh, Clayton Keller, is there gonna be anything good here? Thomas Shabbat, Wenberg, oh boy. Mark Giordano. Two cards left. That is it. Oof. That one is an oof pack indeed. And here we go. Last pack. Jumbo NHL players pack again. Hoping for something better. I think the highest we pulled in the last pack was an 82. So hopefully we can do better than that. We got a Justin Falk, Brock Besser. Come on. Something good here. I want to see if we could top that ADB. Phil Kessel. Okay. Another Leaf Legend. Uh, Philip the No guy cannot score a goal to save his life, unfortunately. Kevin Hayes, Jack Campbell, Quinn Hughes. Oh boy, I don't think we're gonna pull anything else. Thomas Tatar. All right, Dubois, and that is it. But hey, we cannot complain with that 88 ADB. So just to give you guys a little update with this Austin Matthews. Um, I am currently six gold collectibles off of him. We easily have over 200 gold players just chilling in our collection right now. And like what I want to do ideally is kind of wait uh, until Friday to see if EA will um, drop a set like they have in the past where they, uh, where you trade in a hundred gold players for three gold collectibles. So essentially you're trading a hundred gold players for two gold collectibles, you get the third one free. So the day I'm recording this is Thursday. I might as well just wait an extra day, which is Friday. This video is going out on the Monday. Now I'm gonna want you guys to assume um, on Friday, if the set does not come out, that I'm gonna be building the gold collectibles and I think I'm and I have enough to make those six gold collectibles with all the players I have now, which is absolutely huge. So um, that's probably gonna be it for today's video. We did pull a purple player. It was a great purple player pull as well. We are closer and closer to this 95 Matthews. Um, but yeah, that is it for today's Road to Austin Matthews. Again, um, essentially in the next video, I think we might be able to get him, if not the video after that. But yeah, that is it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy, be sure to drop a like on it. If you guys are new around here, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. We are on the road to 4,000 subscribers. But yeah, thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!